hard to tell how. Hi, and welcome here again live from Mobile World Congress 2019. I'm here at the Huawei stand, and I would like to show you something really exciting the, the world's first 5G foldable phone with a foldable OLED display. Now, why do I show you this? Well, it has nothing to do with virtual reality. As you know, MRTV is all about VR and AR, but I still want to show device because it has this foldable OLED screen and well this is something that we're going to see in VR headsets quite soon I believe so so therefore I would like to show you the Huawei Mate X the world's fastest foldable 5G phone and you can see it right now so here it is you cannot touch it it's behind glass Oh, actually, I could touch it, uh, but uh, don't do it. I think it's better not. But um, yeah, look at look at how how clear this is. This OLED screen is. It is really remarkable. It is completely remarkable, and um, it looks amazing. So close. So let me go. But he's behind glass here. Actually, I can go closer. <laughs> So yeah, so what we're looking at here is a 5 inch foldable OLED full view display with falcon wing design it says. World's first 7 nanometer 5G chipset inside. World's fastest 5G phone up to 4.6 giga per second downlink speed at sub 6 gigahertz band and it has a 4500 milliampere long lasting battery so this screen is truly truly amazing wow and uh, let me see if I can get a closer look okay this is as close as I can get to the screen Simply look at it, wow, and something like this in a VR head folded, this should be pretty, pretty spectacular. So enjoy this while, <laughs> while it lasts here. So unfortunately, this is really as close as I can get to it. I can uh, film a bit from above. Oh, actually, you can go to the back. So I will try to have a look at it from the back as well. So this is how it looks from the back. Yeah, so even if this doesn't really have anything to do with virtual reality or augmented reality, Still, I want to show you the Mate X simply because of the foldable OLED screen. So I believe that we're going to see something like this in a virtual reality headset soon. Uh, Samsung already has some patents um, for it. So I'm really looking forward to see this kind of technology very soon uh, in our VR headsets. <laughs> so, thanks for watching this. And um, if you like this broadcast, definitely give it a thumbs up. And of course, I look forward to see you in 